Hi, welcome to another Harry Helps. This six tips a simple one. I get asked an awful lot in lessons, which club should I chip with? Uh, the answer I always give is exactly the same every time, which is the club you need. And without sounding too flippant about it, that really is the explanation. So a simple way of thinking about chipping. I've got three, I've got a proper flag, and then I've got two imaginary flags, as you can probably see by a yellow cane and a white cane. The yellow cane is only a few yards on the green, the white cane is halfway up the green and the flag is quite a long way up the green. So the reality of chipping is, think of it as what would you do if you were going to throw a ball. So if you've got a ball in your hand, going to the first flag, this yellow one on the right here, you wouldn't roll that up this bank up to that flag because there's a little bank in front of us. You just generally tend to just throw it up in the air, it'll stop fairly quickly and goes out right next to the flag. If you were going to the middle flag, I defy anybody going to the, to the middle flag, the white flag, you wouldn't throw it up in the air to go to the white, the white post. You tend to go a little bit lower than the first one, so you'd throw it up onto the green and let it run out to your flag. So you've thrown it a bit and you've let it run a bit. So if you think of the first one we did, we've thrown it straight up in the air, we want it to stop fairly quickly, so that's a sand iron. If you go to the middle one, we want it to land on the, throw up in the air a little bit, land on the green, and then roll out a little bit, not massively. So you're probably talking something like a nine iron. As soon as we get to that back flag, once again, there's no way anybody would throw a ball way up into the sky to get it to go to that back flag. Natural instinct for most people is you're gonna get down on the ground, terrible throw, but you're gonna get down on the ground and roll it to that flag. Roll it along so that it goes along nicely, all about the green, roll, 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 all about the green. So think in terms of your chipping as the same. That last one, I'd probably be using a seven iron. The white uh, stick, second one, nine iron. First one needs to stop on a sixpence, sand iron. So whenever you're faced with a chip shot, just stand over it and think to yourself, hmm, how would I roll a ball? How would I throw a ball? Would I elevate it to stop it? Would I throw it along the ground to run it? Simple way of thinking about which club to use. Give that a go.